The Nile turned to blood. Frogs, lice, darkness, death. Were the ten plagues of Egypt just a myth? Or could they have been real? Around 3,500 years ago, a massive volcanic eruption rocked the island of Santorini, just north of Egypt. It was one of the most powerful eruptions in recorded history. Ash, gases, and shockwaves spread across the region, and some scientists now believe this eruption triggered a domino effect. The river turning to blood. That could have been red algae blooms caused by volcanic ash contaminating the Nile. With the water toxic, frogs fled the river. Then came the insects, lice, and flies, breeding uncontrollably. Diseased animals followed. Then, the skin boils, possibly from ash particles or infected insects. Hail mixed with fire? That could be volcanic debris raining down with lightning storms. And the darkness? A thick volcanic ash cloud blanketed the sky for days. As for the final plague, the death of the firstborn, some suggest a toxic gas or food contamination struck those closest to the ground first, often the eldest child sleeping nearest to the floor. Was it divine judgment? Or a perfectly timed natural disaster that shook a nation to its knees? Faith and science might not always agree, but when they overlap, the story gets even more fascinating. If this blew your mind, hit that like button and subscribe for more mind-opening biblical discoveries.